Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys, man. Um, I don't know what's going on with the game of boxing, but, you know, um, a lot of these boxers is putting themselves in positions to where they're just starting to look more and more like just straight up cowards or just suckers. A lot of these boxers are just on some sucker shit now, and they trying to fool the fans like, you know, like they about fighting the best out there when they really ain't. Either they trying to get a quick money grab on their way out of boxing, or they trying to make as much money as they can without taking a, a, a meaningful fight. And this is just going on with all the boxers, not just any particular group of boxers, any particular race. This is just going on with all boxers. But uh, case in point, man, um, I saw an article on uh, boxing scene with Sean Porter where Sean Porter says, basically, uh, to make a long story short, he's he don't see himself retiring without fighting Errol Spence. Now, I don't know if you've seen some of the interviews with uh, barbershop conversation, but um, you know, um, Kenny Porter was hinting that Sean Porter wasn't going to be fighting too long, and they was talking about exit strategies and all this shit. So basically, what it sounds like, they don't want to fight Errol Spence right now, while it's like a meaningful fight. They are considering fighting Errol Spence as like a last fight or retirement fight or some shit like that. So basically what happens here is let's just say Sean Porter loses to Errol Spence, which more than likely he will. He'll say, oh, well, this is my last fight anyway. He doesn't want to take the fight while, while he's considered an active fighter. So, you know, basically if he loses, you know, sort of he, you know, drops down in rankings and all that type of shit. So to me, that's just some real sucker shit right there. If I was Errol Spence... I would tell Sean Porter, no, you're not going to use me as a big money exit strategy fight. Either fight me now or you're not getting the fight. You know what I'm saying? So that that's just hella fake, man. You know, because sort of like, I mean, it's a win on Errol Spence's record, but it's not as meaningful as it would be as, like you guys are fighting for basically a spot on the pound for pound list or fighting for a championship. So it's just really weak. So, I'm just keeping it 100, man. That's some real sucking shit by uh, Sean Porter to even say something like that. But it just goes to show you the fear that Errol Spence uh, strikes in a lot of fighters. But anyway, man, that's all I got to say about that. I'm out.